All right, well, this is just going to be a uh, quick little video. Um, somebody in the comments uh, actually asked if I could take apart the uh, TS-335. Heck, like me, they have both of them, but uh, I guess they're looking to um, possibly change out the bearings for something else. I don't know, but either way, sure, it's easy enough to do, as long as I remember which side I actually need to uh, unscrew. So there's the pivot. And... The back one here. That will let me take this off. And there's a hidden screw under there. So I'll set that aside somewhere else. All right, and let's try to uh, yep, just shove that out. And hey, here we go. Everything's kind of coming apart. Yep, so it's got the uh, the tiny bearings rather than the uh, large ones. Uh, something that uh, Max Chatuk ends up uh, using in a lot of his designs. Uh, yeah, still very, very uh, easy and simple to uh, disassemble. We got the, uh, the liners here with the uh, ceramic bearings on each side. So, I think probably what would be best, uh, since I don't necessarily know of um, replacement parts or anything like that for uh, these bearings, but I will actually, there we go, get you some uh, caliper measurements and whatnot. So the, uh, the pivot is uh, basically four millimeters. Uh, so that's a little bit smaller than their other ones that are, I think, six millimeter. So yeah, you got a four millimeter um, inner diameter of that uh, little bit there, which means this is going to be metric. Let's see, so we got basically 7.8 or so for um, the, uh, the outside diameter. I mean, obviously that's going to be the same if I... Uh, do that uh, and the thickness it's going to be basically uh, just shy of one millimeter but uh, yeah so uh, at least for that I hope that it uh, helps you out uh, like I said I'm not really familiar with a whole lot of um, different replacement bearings and whatnot I have purchased some for a knife that I still don't have yet that being the uh, the Kershaw Lucha in uh, 20 CV, which um, I pre-ordered almost a year ago, and uh, they still haven't produced the darn things, so that's a little frustrating, but I do have uh, replacement bearings for it, so that should be fun whenever it gets here, most likely next year at this point. So, uh, all right, that's all I really had. Just someone wanted to uh, see the disassembly and probably some of the uh, the measurements for the, uh, the bearings in case they wanted to replace them with something else. As always, I appreciate y'all for watching. Have yourself a wonderful rest of your day, yo. Okay.